orthopedic surgeon, so I came up a route of orthopedics, uh, and and then did a specialty training in uh, um, cancer care as it sort of pertains to the orthopedic world. So um, basically, um, uh, there's sort of a range of things that I treat, which uh, would involve anything from uh, basic small lumps and bumps that pop up, you know, around the skeletal system, the arms, the legs, the trunk and torso sometimes, uh, to um, cancers that arise in the bone, to uh, uh, cancers that start somewhere else and spread to the bone, um, to um, most things, fortunately, uh, that come to see me um, turn out to be good news. Somebody thinks they may have something and they don't. Uh, or uh, there's a spot that's found on an x-ray you're getting for something else and we look at them and go, yeah, that's perfectly harmless and you're fine. So um, sometimes I get that question, well, how do you do, you know, orthopedics is such a, often a, is sort of a feel-good specialty, how do you bring the oncology? And I'm like, well, on the one hand, a lot of what I do is deliver good news. On the other hand, when people have something serious, they want to have somebody who's competent to take care of it and provide a plan and, and you know, and get them through that. So it's a very small specialty, um, probably, a, you know, a couple, 300 uh, specialists in the country. Um, mostly in um, academic institutions um, and uh, we're fortunate here in our community to have two within the, actually within the Norton system here in Louisville. The conditions that we treat, um, some of them are pretty rare in themselves which is part of it, um, but of course there's a lot of cancer out there. There's a lot of cancer out there that's affecting people's uh, bones and, um, and soft tissues and that correlates into um, pain, it correlates into decreased quality of life, function, and you know, people a lot of times if we have a big destructive spot from a lung cancer or a breast cancer for instance, um, colon cancer, all these what I call the newspaper cancers, the ones that we read about, hear about, see about all the time, um, they can all affect the bone, they can all spread to the bone when they do they're very painful and they're very destructive at times. So um, being able to pro keep people mobile, keep them pain free, keep them Functioning. It's a very, you know, it's a very rewarding thing.